Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got different dimension comment and I'm going to be using the Beauty Big Bang Stampin' Plates. I started off with Glitter Be Gone and here's different dimension comment. And I'm going to go in with my first coat. I've already got my base coat on and dry. And this polish went on like butter. It was so smooth. I didn't have to hardly do any cleanup. I did a little bit but not much. Very nice formula on this one. And on camera, it's looking a lot more like blue, blue, but in real life, it's, it's, it's kind of hard to describe. It's, it's like a blue, greeny, funky color, and I love it. I just, I'm so in love with it. It's, it's sick. But I'm going to go in with the second coat. I probably could have gotten away with one coat since I am doing some stamping today, but whatever. <laughs> I'm going to top it off with some posh top coat and get it to dry down so that I can do my stamping using those plates that Beauty Big Bang sent me. I will have my code down below. It uh, gives you 10% off if you use it. If the code gets used six times, I believe, they will sponsor a giveaway here on our channel at Boom, Moon Baby Nails. And here is Beauty Big Bang 05. I'm going to be using this little plaid-like design. And Beauty Big Bang 06. And I'm going to use the little deer with the trees. I love it. I'll be stamping with Nicole Diary NS04 and my, my new Conad Stamper and Scraper. I'm just going to apply some of that polish and do a scrape and... I'm going to use the rolling motion and pick up that image just perfectly. Now I do bump my nail with it and get some of the design, but I'm just going to try to line it up the best I can. And you know, no harm, no foul. It looks okay. <laughs> We're just going to keep it on there and not do a do-over. There we go. I'm cleaning that plate off with pure acetone. And I'm trying to do the go down the side and swipe another way. And um, as you can see, it's just, it's not working out so good for me. I'm having to do too many swipes. So we're going to go back to doing it the way we were doing it. I love that these images are long enough for my longer nails. And I don't have to do any double stamping. That is lovely. And I do really like all the images on these plates. I've got some more coming from Beauty Big Bang that I purchased with my own money because I really do like their products. Um, it's, I got some flower ones and I believe there's some more Christmas ones coming. So as soon as I can get those in my hands, I will be using them here on the channel. I was so impressed with the quality of these. They're etched really nicely. Um, I know I talked about it when I did my Halloween manicure with the Halloween plates. And I just, you know, I, I decided, okay, let me go out here and see what else they've got. And I found more plates. And I was like, I knew I had to get them. And oopsie, we're dropping some stuff. Dropping that cap to the nail polish. But all is good. We didn't make too bad of a mess. And now we're going to put those little deer and the little pine trees on this other nail. I didn't want to go too Christmassy. I wanted something that would just kind of be you know, appropriate for fall or, you know, the beginning of winter, but not all out Christmas. So I really thought these two images worked really well for that. As you can see, this polish is coming up really well with the tape trick. I'll do a touch up here in a little bit, you know, as usual. I'm going to use my Sonia Kushex Tools number 27 synthetic angled brush that I love to use for cleanup and some pure acetone. I'm just you do a little tidying up because if I seal it in with the top coat then it's kind of harder to clean up so I want to try to make it easy I'll be using this posh top coat if I can get it turned around I'm gonna seal this one in so that the stamp design stays put and then I get to enjoy the manicure for a few days or a couple of days or however long I end up wearing it capping my end and there we go I did that same design on my thumb. I hope you liked this one. Here's my swatch photo. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and until next time, be good to yourself. Bye.